بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم یو کین فائن دی ایونٹ آف آشورا بفور اٹ ہیپن ان دا بکس آف احادیث ان دا بکس آف ٹریڈیشنس ان فیکٹ مینی پیپل کلیم دیٹ اٹ از فاؤنڈ ان دا ہولی قرآن ناٹ اونلی جسٹ ان دا ہولی قرآن بٹ آلسو ان دا بائبل اینڈ ان بکس پرائر ٹو اسلام ویدر ریمبرنس آف ریور یوفریٹس اور ٹائگرس ہیز بین مینشن ان دا بائبل اینڈ ادر ہولی بکس لائک تھورا اینڈ دا ہولی قرآن ان سورہ صافات mentions wa fadainahu bi dhibhin azim we have replaced the sacrifice of ismail with the greater dhibhin azim and allama iqbal dr muhammad iqbal a very famous pakistani poet who is known to be shair e mashriq he says in farsi a couplet allah allah ba bismillah fi dar ma'na ye dhibh e azim ahmad hisar he says that oh allah how great are the father and son the father is the meaning of ba of bismillah and the son hussein is the um, real A reflection, an extension of the Bhayadim, the greatest sacrifice mentioned in the Holy Quran. But in the books of traditions, in Shia Sunni books, like in Jami Tirmidhi and other books, the Holy Prophet has mentioned this to his wife, Hazrat Umm Salama, radiyallahu ta'ala anha, and other companions that my uh, grandson will be uh, killed in the plains of Karbala. And he says that the, he will have the same horse, Al Maymoon, my horse, he will have my same horse. He will be riding it and it will not be Medina, it will be Karbala. And he will be calling people for help. And the Holy Prophet said, when he calls you for help, فَنْسُرُوهُ Then do help him. And Imam Musa Salaam did say, هَلْ مِنْ نَاسِمِ Now, in Jamia Tirmidhi, it says in the Sunni books that Umm Salama, ta'ala anha, the wife of the Holy Prophet, uh, وسلم, she saw a dream when she was sleeping in the noon of Ashura that the Holy Prophet وسلم, came And he had um, dust in his head and his uh, hair were not combed properly and his uh, um, clothing was uh, full of dirt. So she said, Ya Rasulullah, why have you made such a state? So the Holy Prophet ﷺ said, Oh, Umm Salama, my grandson Hussein has been killed in the plains of Karbala and I'm coming from there and I'm really upset. So Umm Salama got up and she... Uh, she had uh, been given some dust from the Holy Prophet ﷺ. The Holy Prophet said, this dust is from Karbala. When it turns into blood, when it changes into blood, uh, or you can see blood inside it, then remember that my grandson Hussein has been killed. And when Imam Hussain was going to Karbala, he came to see his grandmother, Umm Salama radiallahu And he ﷺ said to her, that, oh, grandmother, I'm going to Iraq, uh, I'm going to Karbala. She said, please don't go to Iraq because your grandfather told me that you will be killed in Iraq. He said, this is the time has come. I'm going for my martyrdom, um, for Shahada. So uh, you can see that uh, in historical events, the Holy Prophet ﷺ had mentioned it to his wives and his companions, Sahaba, anhum, and uh, to his family members, Ahlul Bayt, to Ali and Fatima, alayhim salam that Imam Hussain al-Islam will be killed in Karbala. So you can find in many, many traditional books that Imam Hussain al-Islam had pointed out that this is the same sacrifice that my grandfather told you about. I'm going for the sacrifice. In many books of traditions, um, you will come across words where the Holy Prophet says, Allahumma inni uhibba Husayna, fa ahibba man ahibba Husayna. Oh Allah, I love Hussain. And whoever loves him, you also love him. So he prayed that, oh Allah, love the one who loves Hussain. So Imam Hussain was very beloved to the Holy Prophet and you can find those words about his sacrifice in the books of traditions.